we will talk about the sum of products and I will explain what the product is and how we sum them so I would like to show you a, an example first like a very simple example of let's say we have a function that is A or B or C. There are three inputs, three variables and the function, the output is F. So F is your output. Let's see how we will implement this function. Let's say A and B are gonna be ORed first. Let's put it in an OR gate A and B so your output for this gate is going to be A or B and you need another OR gate to add C so this is going to be A or B or C which is your F your function output we can also implement the same function by using an OR gate that has three inputs A B C the output is going to be exactly the same A or B or C Now let's go to a little bit uh, more complicated example. Let's say our function is AB or C not D or C D not. So now we have three terms here and they are all have two inputs so a b c not d and c d not those are all and gates so i can put them with an and gate it's going to be a b then C not D and C D not. So the outputs the first AND gate will give A B, second one give C not D, and third one will give C D not. And then since the outputs of these need to be ORed because of the these plus signs we can now put an OR gate here to realize our function so this is how we would realize a function We have some definitions here. I'll put the function again. In a function, each letter, each of these literal uh, letters is called literals. and each of these terms these are called product product terms so this function has three 
product terms for this particular function we have three product terms and one two three four five six literals doesn't matter if it is complemented or not let's do another example in terms of literals and product terms this is a relatively more complicated a b not b c not d a not d or e not so we have one two three four product terms and one two three four five six seven eight eight literals since we have product terms and these product terms are added to each other or ord each other that's why we call this kind of an expression is sum of products expression it's called sum of products